everyone, my name is Katie and today I'm going to talk about these little bug masks that I made. As you can see, I already started drawing them before recording, mainly because I was experimenting with the symmetry tool and playing around with my different brush settings. But after sketching the this lady with the butterfly headdress, I thought it'd be pretty fun to record and sketch out more masks that are based off of bugs. So some of the insects that I looked at are like butterflies, dragonflies, uh, beetles, uh, maybe I think a few bees and spiders. But just while looking at these different bugs, I was thinking about what kind of details I should be emphasizing or kind of using to create different styles or like masks. Going off of that, I thought about what kind of like personalities or purposes that these masks would have. Some of them seemed more like they would be used for like masquerades or carnivals while others seemed like they were built for battle. Kind of like if someone took like a large fantasy giant bug and like made ar armor out of its carapace, or trying to like think of different story ideas or reasons why these masks, masks would exist. Just kind of expanding beyond the point of drawing a mask for fun, but also thinking about what would its purpose or use be. I also like the little bug right here where it looks like he's a like an acorn or a beetle, like he's wearing a hat almost. Seems like he'd be a pretty big guy, but also a really nice guy. Just someone who'd wish you a good day. Yeah. Also, if you hear chirping in the background, it's just because of my two parakeets, Kiwi and William. They're kind of chilling with me while I talk to you guys, so hopefully you don't mind them. I also thought about like thinking beyond the shape of just like a general mask that would cover your eyes. Just looking at uh, what if a mask would just cover the mouth or like what if it would just cover like the head and just trying to again expand on different shapes and like design language just to create fun little designs. Overall creating these masks was pretty relaxing and fun to make. Hopefully in the near future I can make more videos of sketching out more masks as well as finishing up some of these designs more and bringing them to uh, full illustration. Because like I said, I did finish one of them, which I'll upload soon, but hopefully I can do more of these in the future. So I hope you guys enjoy listening to me ramble on about these sketches and different like designs. If you have any other ideas about different masks or different books I should look at for future videos, just, just let me know in the comments below.